Hey everybody, welcome back. It's a new weekly, finally. I hope you enjoyed the saga of the uh, of the last weekly. You know what? I'm a big believer in this now. I am. I'm a big believer in <clears throat> using the chinchilla slightly. Um, by the way, I have no idea. No, not, not the slightest idea of what this weekly looks like. I Are there moths? I see a moth. I'm a simple man. I see a moth. I move a mouse up. Let me be a, it would be like a perfect fish. Maybe like, um, like a sea bass or something. This is a horrible start. We're just gonna figure it out on the fly, you know? We're not, we, we don't know the, the secret sauce. I mean, I keep saying I don't know the secret sauce, like somebody who does know the secret sauce, but I'm, I'm promising you that I do not know the secret sauce. I swear to you, it's true. Check this out. I know you're like, no, NL, you're gonna be four squatted. Or am I? Because I purchase you, I sell you, I still have a tutu, I roll once, and then we get three moths. Now, is this good? Who's to say? What it is for sure, though, is a level. And we got our ladybug, plus two, plus two, plus the temporary, like, uh, attack bonuses. So, actually, I, I'm feeling pretty smart right now. I'm, I'm feeling at least like I know how to use a chinchilla in a pinch. And I can live with that. Now, I see a croissant. I also see some broccoli. Can I tell you? Can I tell you that I, I, I kind of like the idea of this. I can't verify the integrity of game cash, and I can't verify the integrity of a blowfish long run, or in the long run, I should say, but what I will say for now is I, uh, I enjoy what we've got, and we're gonna draw this one. I don't know why I'm talking like Howard from Better Call Saul. Jimmy? <laughs> it's not even like a good impression. Okay, Jimmy. I don't think we care for a marmoset. I mean, this is just gravy under the bridge right here. Um, let's take a swan. If we can get this blowfish there. I mean, 14 defense is really nice. Um, it would also be nice to have like more than one attack. I understand we're getting some, some value out of the blowfish in spite of that, but you know, it'd, it'd be nice to have a little bit of both. Hey, Lord of the Fishes loses to Perfect Fishes. What can I say? I do actually, I think I, I love the idea of a capybara. It's very interesting. I think I would, I would sell you there. Like, sell you in a good way. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, sell you in a good way. I guess when I said sell you, what I meant was buy you. <laughs> Literally just using the wrong word. Hey, look at that. There's one way. I guess we could just use our moth to give our blowfish some attack, and we would probably consider that to be, like, pretty positive right now because our blowfish also has way more HP. And it would be nice to get a pineapple. Holy cow, would you look at this? And would you look at this? And would you look at this? And we, we don't have a whole lot of attack on the squad in general. I'm going to leave you around. But I, I do kind of want to take a dolphin for some extra sniping potential. I feel like this is a bit nasty, quite frankly. Although they have a 619 blowfish of their own. Um, um, my game? <laughs> Did anyone else see that? Did I just have a stroke? It seems like my game just crashed uh, and then came back. But look at this. No sweat. So far, so good. Four wins, round seven. Why don't you sell me this ladybug? Or sell this ladybug for me? We'll get the dolphin out there. I'll take a, a, a swan. I'll pay you Tuesday for a hamburger today. I'm going to get rid of the capybara. It's been doing good work for us, don't get me wrong. But I think, you know, we need to find something to, to fit a cow. And honestly, for the time being, the extra attack that comes from the moth, I mean, this is nine extra attack on our blowfish. There's something quite uh, quite substantial about it. I think we lose fairly badly to like a, a strong unit with garlic at the front. But for now, like this is, it's getting the job done. That's five. I love playing sap on a Monday, man. It's just, uh, it's just a different world. I don't know if you can get away with this stuff on a, on a later day. There's no pills in the pack this week. No, no, no pills, no pills, no pills, no chocolate. Okay. Normally I find that to be a negative. Um, but because I'm feeling like this weekly is going pretty well, or like this, this particular match is going pretty well, I like that our opponents have less catch-up mechanisms. <laughs> I think it's, 
is better overall for us that our opponents have uh, no recourse to pass us. So that's I, I would describe that as a positive this week. And look at that. We do have a problem. Our, our blowfish, if it dies, um, we have nothing really behind it that provides any sort of you know resistance to the enemy team. That's pretty nice. What do you think about getting? What do you think about getting an octopus in here? It's weird to have an octopus just be like not your frontline unit, but it gives us a chance to maybe do some buffing or something. Um, well, it's it's dead, but in theory it could have. Nice snipe, by the way. Really. Ooh, wait a minute. This team's stronger than mine. Never mind. We still made it. Okay, that takes us to seven. But that team was starting to get a touch a touch scary. Why don't you take some of that? I mean, at this point, what do you... I, I mean, I, I hate to do it because we just got you out there. But what do you think about maybe... Um, we'll buff the the moth. I, I think it's fairly unlikely to matter that much. But at the same time, carrot is a pretty good piece of loot. We got a two, a three, a one, and a three. I would throw a poodle out there for, for now. We didn't buff a dolphin, which seems fine. I'm always wary about like building a team. We need to do a little better than that. I'm wary about building a team with no like defensive unit. Like our, our tankiest unit has a pineapple on them. And I think the pineapple does make sense, but we wouldn't mind wouldn't mind getting a little better. I'll take five attack. I'll take some of this. You want to do me a favor and just for now take a, a melon just so you get an extra chance to attack? And I would probably... I would probably sell a poodle to buff uh, a blowfish even further. To go even further beyond. <clears throat> um... Are we okay? Are we okay? We're, going, we're kind of going back and forth here. I feel like we're talking past each other. <laughs> Wait a minute. We won. Okay. Good stuff. It's getting a little sloppy here, but that's the way some people like it. Uh, I think we'll buy... Uh, no, don't buy the orange. Sell the poodle. Get you out here. We haven't seen any other scalers, right? Like, is there a giraffe this week? No. There are. There's a penguin. There's a poodle. There's a dragonfly. There's monkeys. We haven't seen any of them, I think. Which is uh, a bit dicey. Why don't you, I mean, if you could get to level three, it would be nice. I'm still gonna just keep pumping your stats for now, as long as I can, at least. A hammerhead shark. We do have a level three. Why not? Why not give it a try? Bullet ball extreme. It'll catch your eye. Actually, I don't know. I gotta think. Round twelve, adding like one monkey is not that exciting. But maybe it's more important than having um, like a level two swan. I, I could definitely see someone making that case. It's a strong kangaroo, man. That's a strong. That is a strong kangaroo. You are not joking. And yeah, we're so close. Okay, eight wins. Well, you should take this. Maybe I'm gonna say forget this for now. I know it seems a little crazy. We have so much gold. We have so much gold. Am I really gonna sell a, a dolphin to add a cow to get like a little bit of extra HP? I can't believe that I'm doing it, but here I go doing it. I'm gonna buff our moth so it gets buffed a little faster. I'm gonna sell a cow. I'm gonna buy an orange. I'm going to roll and I'm going to roll. I really thought we could get something a little better, but you know what? We, we have a sauropod that sounds like the opening to Bros by Panda Bear. And now we can buy a bunch of food, but I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with it. I got no idea. I'm scared. Yeah, we're, I, I think that we just didn't, we didn't commit hard enough. Or maybe we committed too hard. But we still got eight. That's not too bad. I actually thought we had some life left, but um, let me get a, a fish. A ladybug and then an otter. Hit the ladybug. Okay, fair enough. Now we know we got mods, so let's set it up like this. Let's keep an apple out here. Let's be um, let's be an innocent uh, computer. Computer that didn't do anything wrong. I'm trying to work a, a joke in there. I don't know if there is one. Something about a PC stands for police constable as well. I don't know where I'm going with it, but here's what I do know. I'm going to say I like this. I'm going to say I like this. 
That's fine. I'm going to add you to the squad. And uh, another fish is good. Squad's a little... We'd really like to see an otter, I guess is what I'm trying to say the most. I think we lose this one. Not by much, but still. An otter or like more fish? No otter. Somebody should take a croissant. And I think it should be you, just because your stats are the best already. Roll me. Roll me. Okay, that's uh, a little horrendous, but we know at some point we're going to want the the mouse to be sold. Why not do it early? And uh, let's just throw a flamingo at the front for now. It, it's not that great because we know we can't kill it, but it's good, like, anti-moth technology, and they do have a moth, so I'm, I'm feeling smarter than I thought I was. <clears throat> This team is, like, not bad. It just it needs some consolidation. We need our levels. I'm going to even level up, like, out of order, probably. Like, just take this one for now. Let's say no to a blowfish for now. We got another dromedary. Um, to be honest, I think I would rather just have... Yeah, yeah, something like that. I think I would rather have two dromedaries... So that the otter is going to get super buffed, and it's going to give out a buff itself that's quite prodigious, and then it's going to level as well. And it's, it's going to give us a level, and, and then the world's our oyster. Allegedly speaking, and look at this as a win. We can always consolidate our dromedaries to, get, uh, to pick up whatever animal we get on the level up, if the animal is good. I mean, it's pretty not bad. I might consider, like... Combining you, tossing this out there, freezing you. I was kind of hoping to get another one, but that's okay. Another fish, that is, but that's okay. Or another dromedary. I'd take another dromedary as well. Names in this game, they get a little crazy, man. I don't, I don't know what these names are supposed to be. This is the greatest B of all time. I'd like to congratulate you on, on that. Well played. And yet, would you look at this? I didn't think we had it in us. No pineapple required. I mean, honestly, if the fish is going for it, let's let's give him a chance. I respect I respect that as well. I respect the level up. It's the perfect time for it to happen. And then we're not really using the dromedary for anything, but it has a croissant. It's basically just a croissant holder. It's like my left hand when I'm leaving a cafe. This is a huge loss. You notice it's very early this week, but a couple of wasps have done serious damage to us. Which scares me because I don't know how to use the unit effectively. Okay, this is... It, it's non-negotiable. You need to take a monkey onto the squad. Now, whether or not we keep the turtle... I think we, I think we will keep the turtle. So that answers that question. Um, and we could probably give the turtle some garlic if it's going to keep getting buffed here. I know that it's not got a lot of attack, but it's still pretty early. This is where, like, a moth would actually help us out quite a lot, but... Okay, this could have been unfortunate, but instead we're looking pretty solid. We got the scaler we're looking for. I, I could rework the whole squad to be scalers if we get, like, a dragonfly fast enough. Did you take one of these? You take one of these. Roll me once. Nothing we're that interested in, so take some garlic. The flamingo can definitely go, too. I guess it got a lot of stats off the otter, but... This is a scary looking team too, honestly. Wait a minute, wait, wow, 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 we made it! To lose, just not by as much as I thought we were gonna lose by, but still. Okay, what are we on? We're on six, we're on five. Keep pushing, we got a little bit more to go. Why don't you take some of this? I think you sell a flamingo at this point. And you rock... A penguin, you'd love to get a next level penguin. The fish first, I was like immediately vindicated for not buying that second penguin right away, but we know which two units are going to get buffed. A level two turtle would hit the spot here. We got some actual scaling, no chocolate, so we're just rolling for, I mean, at this point we're like, we're kind of sunk in. Like it's, I think it's the shop that's going to determine whether or not we succeed. It's just pure luck on the numbers there, but I'll take it. Because um, we can't really afford to sell any of our existing units don't really need a monkey or a, a tiger on the squad here 
I would say, honestly, I'm feeling pretty solid. Like, if we get one more penguin, one more tiger, like, we're, we're not looking too bad. The, the only thing that's annoying is that the penguin is kind of, like, stinky. Like, the fact that it, it only buffs two units maximum means that, like, on level up, we're, we're actually making it, like, a little bit worse a lot of the time. But still feeling pretty good. Don't hit my scalers. That's, I'll live with that. Can't cry about that too much. Nothing of value here. Okay. How about uh, you just take a chili pepper so we got something to do with our three gold. How does that sound? I don't know if we're making it, but I do know we got a we got a pretty nice turtle here. I would say, it, it, were this the master of disguise, I would just go ahead and say that I probably am turtly enough for the turtle club. And, and was that the chili pepper heard around the world or what? Why don't you go ahead and give me some soft ice and... Uh, I'll, I'll just put a grape on a monkey for now. Like I said, we're pretty much, we're just playing go fish in the shop. Now, when your team sucks, rolling for matches feels like, you know, there's no way you're ever going to come out of it. When your team is pretty good, you're not sweating it as much. Oh, you, you piece of crap. How strong are you? Strong enough to, to live without you? Like, sh like the share song? Never mind. Dude, the chili pepper was the most astute decision of my entire life. I can't believe it, Chili Penguin. Jesse Pigman was right. Okay, that's another level, which will make our turtle level faster. Penguin gets a little worse, but that's okay. Why don't we take one of those and then just roll once? Okay, um, still feeling still feeling quite nice. Now, if we get that turtle to level three, we need to move the penguin back one. But that's still, I mean, it, of all the problems to have, that's, uh, that's a good one. You're going to hurt me. You're going to hurt me quite a lot here. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that one bit. Alrighty. Fair enough. This is quite a strong team you've got there. No, oh, I didn't think that was it. I, I have not been paying attention to my, my lethals. Okay, I mean, this is good. This is fine. And I think that you could probably just take a fish, but let's see what we get on our roll. Nothing of value. Okay, so how about something like that? And I'll be uh, an imported ghost. Like, where'd you get your ghost from? Oh, <laughs> it's from Europe. I thought, oh, you did notice. You noticed the ghost, huh? That's a nasty uh, start for us there. That was pretty bad. Definitely like a second fish, though. And uh, a leveled up moth in the future? Sure. Why not? I still don't, I don't really like the optics of this squad for round two. But, you know, they, it's a long game. We got a lot of game left ahead of us. I told you. We, we were way off on that one. Didn't even get to go up against the bee. Didn't even get to see the bee. It's really hard for me to respect the tamarin at this, uh, at this juncture. I think this does better. And then you're like our best unit by far, so why don't you go ahead and take a, a croissant. This one, I definitely feel like I have less momentum going into the... The so-called mid-game, uh, but you know what? It's still uh, still early. This is like a, a guaranteed draw. Man, hurts to know that a single B would have given us a win there, but it is what it is, I suppose. Swan's like it's close. I'd really, this is what I'm rooting for. I'd really like to see the levels, man. I, want, I was just going to say I want to see that fish as well. You know I want to see that fish. So I'm not necessarily suggesting... Um, that this team is doing any better on this round than it did on the last round. I guess all I would say... That's painful. <laughs> is that we got, at least we got some levels coming here. Get ready. So we got some of this. I really don't think a squirrel is that good for us. You know what? I, I gotta... I, I, it's a 2-5. I gotta... I don't know, man. Let's give it a chance. Okay, and then a penguin is at least a scaler. And then I'm like, maybe... It feels weird to give you garlic. Because we don't even have a guarantee that you're going to get a buff. But you are going to get the attack from the, the moth, at least. It's kind of like wishful thinking. This, this should not be a zero win game. Oh, thank God. Hold on. And with the, the early penguin scaling, it does matter. And maybe we can buy some foods with the freaking squirrel, man. So these are all, these cost two instead. 
Well, let's go dub on this. Well, and, and the apple cost too as well. Let's go dub salad. Dub salad me. And then give me two ants. And that just that worked out quite nicely. And we could, if we freeze you, we can get a one cost apple. I gotta say that a one cost apple seems like a pretty good deal. Seems like a pretty good reason to keep a squirrel around. I guess we could also look at the squirrel as like, what if we just kept um, food that we like frozen for like two rounds and then bought it for one gold? Or even cheaper later on. Maybe. Maybe there's something to it. But for now, why don't you take that? And for now, I'm going to ignore that. I'm going to take a two-cost salad. <laughs> I think I am going to sell my squirrel probably to buy this dragonfly. And the dragonfly is like immediately useful. Yeah, it just makes sense. Because now we got, we're getting one, two, three, three, three per turn, plus an extra four, four. No, an extra two, two from the penguin. I'm not saying it's going to carry us, but it at least gives us a chance to get out of here. And we, we were kind of stuck. I do think we could sell a, a, a fish. Ensure that the buffs go to the moth. We don't lose out on much of anything in the process. I mean, if you were going to ask for, like, a scaling team from what I know about this weekly so far, this is what it would look like. But if we're going to sell the fish, it has to be for, like, the right unit. And we got just nothing right now. Like, it's all... It's pretty much, like, detritus straight across the board, but... We haven't lost the round in a while. We got good scaling. We got a unit that actually has some garlic. We got some killing power. Like, I, I believe my, my take on the issue right now is that we've at least stabilized. So we're not in the process of, like, actively undergoing apoptosis. We just got to, you know, keep an eye on it. And we probably shouldn't evolve our moth anymore. I don't think it's necessary. What about a porcupine instead of a fish? I mean, the fish is so far from being useful. At least the porcupine... It respects buffs, you know? It respects them. You should go, like, I, I think now maybe we want to do it like this. I'm going to take advantage. I'm, I'm not sold that we're going to continue to buff the porcupine forever, which is why I didn't give it the lemon. I feel like I really enjoyed what that enemy team did to us last time with the Sabertooth, but I gotta wait till tier 6. But at least for now, like, the Porcupine is like a... If things go wrong, at least we got a, a decent unit around that can... I don't expect the trigger to work, but its, it's stats come out nicely. And then, to be honest with you, I know I just invested in you, but I'm like, immediately get out of here, you stink, and I don't like you. Give me some HP, and we might be able to actually move you to the front. I'm, I'm skipping those, though I may regret it. I love that, though. A tiger doesn't really seem that useful. I do understand, the, the, like, a bison, for sure. Nothing too special here. I mean, for one round... We, we're only doing this for one round, because we get tier sixes next. For one round, toss me another penguin. And if you end up buffing the penguin, which you did, <clears throat> so be it. But I'm, I'm rolling, like... It's not all pack one animals, but we're rolling a very pack one, you know, scale heavy life right now. And can I tell you, I, you, you I'm, I'm a looking and I'm a like, as Ben Stiller said in Meet the Fockers, I'm a looking and I'm a like him. Now he was talking about his mother-in-law when he said that. I wouldn't recommend that line of reasoning per uh, personally. Let's take some food. It obviously was not supposed to hit that penguin. Um, I mean, if we're being part of the legitimati with one another, Guaranteed death touch on one of our backline units would be pretty nice. Dragonfly leveling would also be pretty nice. I'm okay with the soft ice, though. Five stat points. I mean, it seemed, it's funny, like, one attack seems so bad. But I don't think it is. Hit the front. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, we still lost. Never mind. <laughs> Like, one attack seems so bad, but if it was, like, two attack to two units, I would be like, hmm, a, a reasonable purchase, to be sure. Maybe maybe it's my brain that's broken. Okay, we're only on six wins. We gotta get a little serious here. Come on. Come on! Nothing's going to level. Let's get the penguin a little closer. 
I'd like to get at least 10, if that's possible. <laughs> Is that too much to ask for? Oh no, look at how strong they are! I can't do this, are you crazy? Wait a minute, I can draw! Holy cow, I think we might have gotten a little lucky there. Oh, that was a strong looking team. Level three penguin. You see the problem here, right? Like, I don't want to get, whoopsie. Forgot I had so much gold. I don't want to get rid of my lemon or my garlic. Which is why I'm not putting the walrus up at the front. But maybe I should be putting the walrus up at the front. Have you ever considered this? You, you heard of this idea? Okay, this is, this is pretty bad for business. That's not any better. We are dead. Okay. Well, we lost the plot somewhere there. But it's still a pretty good start to the weekly. We had like an 8, 9, 6. I'll take that. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. That was a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For your likes, watch and I'll see you next time. See ya!